Hello and welcome to the Anoeta here in San Sebastian. And I'll tell you what, I hope that we're devouring plenty of exciting football. I'm Derek Ray and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And we're focusing on, technically speaking, one of the best leagues in the world. I'm talking, of course, about La Liga. It's Real Sociedad and they take on Osasuna. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And the keeper getting across to stop it. And taken short. Silva, terrific block. Could be dangerous. And whipped into the box. And a struggle to get it away properly. Well, threat over for now. Ezekiel Avila. Well, a badly timed run. Just a fraction offside. Marino. And he could really get at the opposition. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Moncayola. Ezekiel Avila. Toro. It's with Brazanats. Takes the shot. And that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. Now sending it in. It didn't happen for them. A really committed challenge and it's gone out for a throw-in. Diego Rico. Oya Sabal. Silva. Oh, terrific piece of goalkeeping.
he's fired over the corner well nothing comes of it well he really read that brilliantly untidy in possession Oyar Sabal and the body in the way And to Budimir. Brazanats now. Really important piece of last ditch defending. Oyar Sabal. Now can they counter clinically? Marino. Not a successful intervention, winning the ball back. Now, let's see what they can do here. Options in the centre. Foiling them effectively. Well, as the stats show us, this has been a really even game so far. There just hasn't been enough guile or invention in the top third of the field from either team, which needs to change at some point. Oh, he's through here! And the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say, Derek, he was always in control of that situation. Brilliant stuff. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. Playing it short. And he takes on the shot. Body in the way. Moncayola getting in there to take it away Oyar Sabal Marino so the whistle then we're up the halfway stage in this match. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Alexander Surlot. Ezekiel Avila. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Can they forge ahead? They do. And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. So underway again here, 1-0 to score. 
Moncayola. Adnan Yanuzai. Plenty of options. Precise ball movement. It's got to be! And the keeper throws himself up the ball. Let's see about the delivery. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. And into the last 30 minutes now. Alexander Surlot. He must finish! Oh, not to be! That would have put them well on their way, Stuart. Well, that could prove to be a big miss. Surely has to score there. That's fine play to keep control of the ball. And he read it superbly. Alexander Surlot. Well, Real Sociedad have controlled the flow of the game in the last 15 minutes. And their attacking play has been excellent. Oh, they could put it away, Stuart. And he's got and scored to level it again. Well, you have to admire this bit of play. Just look how he runs with the ball. He always looked in control, didn't he? That's a brilliant goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Alexander Surlot. Rafinha possession given away unfortunately a chopping challenge and the referee has got to have a big think about it well deemed to have been a cautionable offence well no question about it he deserved his book in there David Garcia the ball with Lucas Toro defensive roadblock in the way of that cross delivering it and the delivery lacked a bit of guile giving the ball away beautifully disguised ball Oh, good save to keep it all square. Well, that's a vital stop. What a good save that is. All even, but will it stay that way? And the cross into the middle. A goal! They've done it on the rival's home patch. Will that be the decider? Well, it's a goal you'd expect him to score, but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely. He'll be happy with that. So a personnel change then. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Oyar Sabal. Lenormand Isaac they get forward but time is very much against them here Juan Cruz well almost at full time and this is not really what the home fans had in mind Stuart interested to get your thoughts as always 
Well, it's been a fairly even match, but at key moments, they've just been second best. They could have defended better for the goals, and they've missed opportunities at the other end. It'll be a disappointing result if it stays this way. Making sure nothing came of it. And there goes the final whistle, much to the disappointment of their supporters. Yes, Derek, there was very little in it for much of the game. I'm sure they feel they deserve a point at least. And it's obviously disappointing to concede in that manner so late on. But they just have to bounce back now. And I think it's fair to say he'll be happy with his own contribution in this game, Stuart. Well, he obviously scored the winning goal, but it was his overall performance that impressed me most. He was on fire today.